Well, hey, I'm Chris, and I'm over here in the labs at 3M, and what I'd like to show you today is how I laminate a 3M mobile privacy screen protector to an iPad 2. You'll get your screen protector in the packaging, and then also part of the packaging, again, is uh, the squeegee. A couple other useful tools are a simple piece of tape and a cleaning cloth. So the first step is to make sure that the iPad screen is clean and free of dust. So the home button is used for centering, and then that bottom edge of the protector, I'm going to make sure that's parallel with the bottom edge of the iPad too. One of the tricks for laminating to help get rid of dust is not to pull that liner back all the way up. Peel back the liner, maybe about an inch or two. And with my free hand, I'm going to be ready to tack it down once I like the alignment. And if you don't like the alignment, it's easy just to pick it back up and try again. All right, so once you have it aligned and tacked down at the bottom, it's as easy as pulling off the liner with one hand while pressing it down with the other. So if you do end up with bubbles, uh, there's two kinds. Without dust underneath them, you can push them out. And bubbles that do have dust, you can get out using the tape trick. So then use one piece of tape to lift up the film, and then I'm gonna go back to the simple easy tape, easy scotch tape here. Press the film down where the dust is, and that tape will lift the dust right off of the privacy protector. All right, so now it's on, it looks good, and now it's ready to be used, either for privacy or be able to share.